providing some relief for the anti-casino groups, the State Port Minister Francisco Pacheco assured Assembly House to seal the floating casinos operating without no objection certificates from the Port Administration. The Minister, in his reply, tabled on the floor of the House, stated that of the six casinos, five casinos that had obtained NOCs have expired. He assured the House that all the activities on these casinos would be stopped. Speaker, sir. Jenna, the NOC cover the Lupra and the letter early. And nowhere it says, Speaker, sir, when the learned AG told us not to touch them, but nowhere it says that the, the, uh, the, uh, the operation has to be stopped. But yeah. I'll give an answer in this house, Speaker, sir. Uh, I'll make sure I'll seal the, all the activities going on those uh, uh, casinos. Uh, sir, I'll give you an answer in this house that all the activities going on on, on these uh, ships. Five. Uh, five. I'll make this, this, this activity will be sealed. Only one casino, MV Arabian Sea King, has valid documents given by the captain of Ports Department. The opposition benches, led by the leader of the opposition, Manohar Parikar, on Monday questioned the state government's wisdom to allow the casinos in the state waters without possessing valid no objection certificates. The data tabled on the floor of the House indicate that the NOCs obtained by all the five casino vessels have expired this year. Mr. Pacheco said that the captain of ports has served notices to all the vessels directing them to ship their vessels from River Mandawi to Outer Anchorage and Aguada Bay. It's because, sir, soon after, before the uh, uh, NOC expired, we had uh, sent a letter to them to move, uh, 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 move to Aguada Bay. I'll give, you, I'll, give you the, I'll give you the date. the cabinet decision soon after the cabinet decision, uh, the department sent a letter to do all this. Uh, what is the date? I'll give you the date. But soon after the cabinet decision, we send them letter to, to move to the uh, Aguada Bay. Mr. Pacheco further said that vessel owners have filed writ petition in the High Court of Bombay at Goa challenging the notices. He said that the Advocate General representing the state, Subodh Kantak, has made a statement in the court that no action will be taken in pursuance of the order. The state cabinet earlier this year had resolved to move out the offshore casinos from the Mandui River as they caused hindrance to other vessels such as the iron ore carrying barges in the navigational channel used.